in Los Angeles in February of 1903, Johnson beat Denver Ed Martin to win the unofficial Negro Heavyweight Championship. He then defeated the other three best black heavyweights of his day. Sam McVeigh, Joe Jeanette, and Sam Langford. Johnson sometimes took it easy on black opponents, turning prize fights into mere exhibitions. He fought his friend Joe Jeanette five times in one year. But lesser white opponents who dared to get into the ring with Johnson often received very different treatment. He savaged Jack Monroe, knocked Joe Grimm down more than 20 times, knocked out Charlie Hughes in one round, demolished former heavyweight champion Bob Fitzsimmons in two. When John L. Sullivan, the old champion, helped groom a one-time wrestler named Kid Cutler, especially to defeat Johnson, Johnson did away with him in the first round then shouted to Sullivan, How'd you like that, Captain John? Johnson was beginning to develop his own distinctive style in the ring. Smooth, laid back, defensive. He took few chances, picking off his opponent's punches with his gloves, waiting for the other man to make mistakes, then counterpunching or tying him up. It was not a style calculated to appeal to those fans who had paid to see a brawl. But it baffled his opponents and won him fights. <laughs> 